if a horse is acting up, there's a reason for it. And it's not just that because he wants to act up. He doesn't really want to act up. He wants to be feel safe and comfortable. And you know, when the horse isn't doing what you're asking it to do, you know why they do it for a reason. They don't do it because they get together the night before and say, let's not pick up the left canter lead tomorrow. You know, let's all, uh, it doesn't work that way. So there's a reason they're not doing what you're asking. The reality usually is there's a lot going on. There's stuff going on with your horse and it may not be terrible, you know, but there's, a, there's always something going on with your horse if your horse is doing anything or has any history or is even on the planet. You know, there's gonna be stuff going on with your horse. Everything we're working on in the body is caused by something. It could be just the work, like a normal human athlete. You know, they, they just get sore. And, and then, as a human, we can do something about it. You know, I'm sore, I'm gonna go get a massage, I'm gonna take a hot bath, um, I'm gonna see the chiropractor. A horse doesn't have that option. They hold tension in their body and pain and discomfort, and they survive by just blocking it out. It's tension that they just accumulate through daily life, just through, could be through work and the job they're doing. Or it could be caused by other things. Some of the other, which I call primary issues. Sore feet or foot issues, dental issues, saddle fit. In the wild, they're just naturally programmed to just block out any, any discomfort at all. Uh, because if they start to drag a toe or something, they, they go to the top of the menu on the survival program. I look at making the distinction between pain and restriction. So a horse may not be doing something if you're asking it to move or do in a certain way. It may not be doing it because it's physically uncomfortable, there's pain there. Or it may be just because there's restriction, which is stiffness, you know, lack of mobility. So there's no pain anymore. You know, usually restriction is an older issue or a chronic issue. Pain, whatever's causing the pain is happening right now. So when you ask the horse to bend and he can't bend just because he doesn't bend there, that's, that's different. Still, you're not getting what you're asking for. You know, the horse can't do it or doesn't want to do it because it hurts.